So you've landed on the New Madrid Earthquake Catalog search page, and here's how we're going to get our first catalog of earthquakes out of here. First, I'm going to change the year to 2011, and then in this box, I'm going to change it to 2012. And you'll notice that this gives me a full year of earthquakes. It's actually not crucial that you pick the exact same year I did, but in this example, I'm just going to pick 2011. I do want you to get a full year, so. Now, in the magnitude range, we'll just leave this alone. For the Latlon box search, we are going to change these numbers around slightly from the defaults. The minimum latitude we're going to use is 34 degrees, and the maximum latitude we're going to use is 39 degrees. The minimum longitude we are going to use is negative 92 degrees. That's 92 degrees west. And the maximum longitude is going to be negative 87 degrees. So that's 87 degrees west. Now, leave the radial search numbers alone, and we are ready to just click Begin Search. OK. So now we pop up the Catalog Search Results page. Um, you can click here, and you will see your catalog. You can go up to the File menu and save the page as some plain text suitable for importing into your favorite plotting program. If you go back to the Catalog Search Results page by clicking the Back button on your browser, you can also read a description of the catalog information, which tells you what's in every column of your text file. And I also want you to generate a map. You can play around with all of these options on your own, but clicking Generate Map will generate a map of the catalog you just made. It looks like this. I want you to save this map somewhere to your computer and paste it into your problem set for turning in later on. That's all there is to it.